hyphens was served. This is our Kfone 360 reader. It's time to talk about the best tips to fix chat GPT not working with Siri on iPhone and iPad. While chat GPT is not perfect in all aspects, no one can deny the fact that it's a top-notch AI chatbot that excels in providing natural human-like responses. Interestingly, you can even integrate this chatbot with Siri through a cool Siri shortcut to get the most out of it on your iPhone. Though I have loved using chat GPT with Siri on my iPhone, it is unfortunately not the case with a good many iPhone users. If you have also run into the same problem and are looking for ways to fix the issue, I have got you covered with some workable solutions. That said, let's dive right in. First off, ensure that you have a proper internet connection. The very first thing that you should do to resolve the chat GPT not working with Siri problem is to make sure that you have a stable internet connection. Knowing that Siri requires a strong internet connection to work, be sure your cellular or Wi-Fi connection is not sluggish. You can easily reset your cellular or Wi-Fi connection by turning on and off the airplane mode. Simply bring up the control center on your iPhone or iPad and then hit the airplane mode icon to turn it on. Now wait for some time and then hit the airplane mode icon to turn it off. Next, trigger the shortcut and ask it to perform a common task like writing an email to check if you have gotten the better of the problem. Then I would suggest you to make sure you have allowed Siri to be accessible on the lock screen. Be sure you have allowed Siri to be accessible from the lock screen. Keeping privacy in mind, iOS offers you the option to disallow the virtual assistant from being invoked from the lock screen. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Now scroll down and choose Face ID or Touch ID and Passcode. Now scroll down to the Allow Access with Log section and then make sure that the toggle for Siri is enabled. Next up, make sure you have properly integrated ChatGPT with Apple Shortcuts app. Note that this hack requires using ChatGPT API key, but fret not, you can find the API key through your OpenAI account, which is available for everyone to use. Besides, I would suggest you to delete the shortcut and set it up again from scratch. Next up, be sure Siri is not down. If Siri server is going through an outage, it will misbehave and won't work reliably. Therefore, go to the Apple system status web page and then ensure that the circle next to Siri is green. If the circle next to Siri is orange, you can't do anything but wait until Apple resolves the problem. Then ensure that chat GPT server is not down either. Due to the error mounting demand, OpenAI is finding it a bit tough to manage ChatGPT server. Thus, if you can't use this AI chatbot with Apple's virtual assistant, despite checking off all the basics, make sure that ChatGPT server is not down. Simply open a browser and then head over to OpenAI's official site to find if everything is all right. And finally, I would suggest you to update your iPhone or iPad. Outdated software versions could also be equally responsible for the ill-functioning of chat GPT on your iOS device. Hence, update your device to the latest available software version. To do so, open the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Now tap on General. Then tap on Software Update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS or iPadOS and you are good to go. That's pretty much it. So these are the best tips and tricks to fix chat GPT not working with Siri on iPhone and iPad. Hopefully you have gotten the better of the problem. If you have found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye. -bye.